So it looks like Void and Keemstar are getting cancelled for referencing the late singer Jung Un in a song titled K pop stands this track. A website called allkpop.com said that YouTuber Keemstar and Void are under fire for using footage of the late Jung Un's funeral, Jung Un's funeral in it. His K-pop stand this track, and you know what? Maybe that was a little bit insensitive, but at the at the same time, the K-pop stands, which was the song, was referred to the K-pop stands in general. They kind of deserve it because they are known to easily start controversies, and therefore. They are easily well known to take down other people, like uh, Jason Derulo, for example. Like last year, I was so angry at the K-pop stands who would do anything to cancel Jason Derulo when obviously he couldn't mention directly mention them. Because one, there was like no room for TikTok to add them on there, and two, they weren't even at at the party for an obvious reason due to the coronavirus, and the K-pop stands forgot that. K-pop stands don't realize that they that they were that they're the K-pop stands don't realize that their favorite band from Korea were mentioned. Even though. Jason Derulo didn't directly mention them. They were mentioned. And today, I'm guessing I'm gonna read all these tweets. Ah, uh, yes, there I see it. I see it now. Okay. Trigger warning: December 18 to suicide. Okay, can we please not do that anymore? It's annoying. If any of you have the time, please look up Team Stars' diss track against K-pop on YouTube and report it. He used pictures from June's funeral as mockery. Maybe if anyone knows his sponsors, you can email them too, so you can hit him or it hurts. Okay, first of all, you are advocating to destroy someone's career. It's, it's just a diss track. It's just a song. If you can't take the heat, don't be on the internet. You guys are not the nicest people in the world, so why should people respect you? Because this was actually directed towards you, not not directly. It's not directly at the K-pop band members. It was directed towards you. That's why the song is titled "K-pop Stands This Track," not "K-pop Bands tr This Track." This is why that this trick had to be up because people like you can't be nice. You're always up to cancel other people for no reason. Stop running your groups or and fan cams under this. What the fuck? This dude nearly put pics of Jung Eun's funeral 
and made fun of his death and suicide in general. On top of that, the video is xenophobic and he mocked eating disorders. It's disgusting and insensitive. How is it insensitive? Before Keen starts a new video, he mocked during suicide and used images from funeral. Okay, the same thing from the yeah, other last two. Don't watch it or give it views. Don't fucking drop hand camps. What he said is beyond vile and disgusting. Worse than anything I've seen in a long time. I am so angry. Report it. No, you cannot do that. You cannot mass report a harmless diss track that is directed toward that is not directed towards him. It's directed towards you. <coughs> you, the idiot K-pop stands. That's why the song is dedicated to you. Because you guys are always doing this. Have you never been taught by your parents that you should not silence people's voice? You doing that is silencing people's voice. That's why I don't like you guys either. Because you're always 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 trying to cancel people who are trying to live their lives i mean seriously i blame the parents who didn't take good care of you very well because one we're in a pandemic so that could be why two your parents are most likely are more are more likely divorced and three, you people have no friends, so you would do anything to cancel people for no reason. Like seriously. You are really that selfish that you want to cancel people like Void and keep Star for no apparent reason. Why do you guys do that? Keemstar has been bombarded by the idiot K-pop stance for what reason, you might ask? Well, as I scroll through these tweets, some of them are calling on YouTube to reconsider, and some say, if you're going to just K-pop stance, this us, don't mention someone's death for your diss track. Okay, so in just about the next clip, I'm about to show you the K-pop stands diss track featuring Kingstar. Because what you're about to find really shows the opposite of what the K-pop stands are saying because they are so confused that they didn't even watch the entire video, which is only 3 minutes and nearly 40 seconds long. Got 
no right I'ma say it once That bitch I'll say it twice President of this bitch So we I'm the vice bitch, hold this fucking flow switch, 40 stands, ain't gon' feed a job for this 40 clip, corporations get in an eight bag like a corn shit, these kids stopping themselves, but they have just can't afford it, hey, can't, can't afford it, ain't healthy, can't ignore it, diesel on these parts, you want that smoke, I fucking floor it, yeah, yeah, I fucking floor it, the dust, I let's explore it, you claiming you an army, but you won't fare this poor bitch, fuck K-pop, I can't say it enough, smoking that K-pop pack, pass around, take a puff, in the streets, got them trapped, got them locked in the cuffs, on Twitter, acting tough, now we call me a bluff, like hell, you can't can't stand up, little stupid bitch, you should've got life for that. I'm killing when the killer keeps stopping. Why this motherfucker track you in the news, you want drama alert? They said you best not be fucking with the BTS. This trade cake 47 right to your chest. They gon' Google for game, I'm a fucking Google for this. It's not been for my third Jimmy, and I said, shut up, it's a... Okay, so it says, oh my god, give it. I don't see anyone that they claim to have, like, mentioned, I mean, we're, we're in the entire video, did it, did, doesn't mention Jung Hoon's name, because this is, this doesn't make any sense. I mean, I don't even know who, what Jung Hoon looks like, and I don't care, because if that were to be offensive, which is not, then these K-pop stands need to, like, grow the fuck up here. I mean, this is a diss track for a reason. It is directed towards the K-pop stands. It doesn't... That doesn't mean that Keemstar probably used Jung's face. That doesn't mean Void used Jung's face either. This doesn't make sense. K-pop stands are just overreacting here. There is nothing in this video that mentions someone's face that they used because that someone died 
or something like that. Like, I don't really know or care. Although, rest in peace to whoever the K-pop stands for mentioning from before. But this doesn't give them an excuse of a free of a free pass to take away someone's rights to to put their music on YouTube. They are taking away someone's rights to put their music on YouTube by reporting it. I mean, I really hope YouTube ignores the the annoying K-pop stance. They do not re represent the today's world. If they want to re represent today's world, then they need to stop acting like little kids. Because that's all they are. They are little kids. Who just want to destroy people's lives. I mean, that's what they're known for. And it's been the past four years. Ever since stupid BTS gained popularity back in 2017. That's all they ever done since. Like, come on. I'm so sick of of the, of the K-pop stands. And I'm so sick of BTS too. I mean, I mean, some of their songs are decent, but I don't like them that much because of these annoying K-pop stands. And these annoying K-pop stands should really go away. They don't deserve to have a fan base. They, and they don't deserve to be a fan base. If they want to represent BTS, then they better do it in a mature way. This right here is immature. Don't report somebody's accounts because you hate the diss track. Because you think that Oh, someone used someone's face because they just died recently. That doesn't give you the right to, like, deplatform somebody for making this track about you, K-pop stands. That's why the song had to be made. So why don't you guys pipe down and live your life and let them live theirs. Thank you very much. You know, I was thinking about this a little bit more. You know, like, why is it that everybody is offended now and everybody is upset? And, and why is it that words hurt people so much? And I think it's because, you know, parents and teachers are now teaching um, their kids that words hurt. Words are painful. And that is the messaging that's being taught to kids. When I was a kid, I was taught by teachers, by my parents, by the principal, like we would have meetings at school and it would be around bullying or whatever. And we were taught at a very young age that sticks and stones will break our bones, but words will never hurt us, right? Like we were taught that we were taught to be tough and to be strong and not let little stuff like that derail us. You know, we were taught to go out there and tackle the world and not be you know emotionally destroyed or you know whatever distracted by this little stuff and just you know go out there and tackle the world nowadays i feel like kids are taught that you know if something is mean is said or whatever that they're supposed to just stop everything stop what they're doing stop their life goals stop their success and um have a little cry time in the corner and it's it's down to that it's got to be down to how we're raising kids um and i i feel like it's a huge disservice you know you know we should be teaching kids to not be hurt by words it makes them stronger makes them more successful makes them more resilient so um yeah just some something to think about Yo, what's up, guys? This is Void here. Today, we're going to be talking about the K-pop stands diss track controversy and the shitstorm us and Keemstar have been going through over the past hours. So, basically, um, Keemstar collabed with us on this song, 
he sent his lyrics to us. We put them together with ours and edited it and put it all together. When Keemstar sent his lyrics to us, he did not see the edit and he did not see our part. So um, he just sent his clips and that was it. That was literally it. Keemstar didn't know about our part or the edit. So Keemstar, I don't know why everyone's on Keemstar, but anyways, go ahead, bro. Yeah, so like, so like you said, bro, Keemstar had no knowledge of, nor did he write or rap any of the bars y'all got a problem with. All right, so the first thing I want to talk about is the bars that y'all got a problem with with us. So, like, you want to play them real quick? Yeah, here we so go. So they know exactly what we're talking about. Well, that bitch ain't no racer. Ha! These finger flickers doing fair enough fist fight. What he's called for races, doing to these kids to say right. Smashing on the motherfucking beat like I'm all mad. I wonder why. Like, these men, they all committed suicide. Stands all around. Why I can't fucking... All right, all right, all right, all right. All right, all right, all right. So, guys, what I'm saying, right? Corporations that ain't treated these kids right. I wonder why lately, man, they all committed suicide. All right, we're talking about Kim and here, Kim here in specific because that's the picture that was used and that's what everybody's so mad about, right? So a lot of y'all, a lot of y'all stands, right? When he committed suicide, a lot of y'all were blaming the over competitiveness and the pressure of the K-pop industry on his death, bro. And what I was doing in that bar right there, I was literally saying these corporations that ain't treated these kids right. I wonder why lately, man, they all committed suicide. I'm clearly stating that the the pressure and the anxiety induced by these corporations that run these K-pop and idol groups is the reason for why they're committed suicide. And I'm saying it's wrong. I'm calling them out, and that's why I'm making a diss track on them. In no way, shape, or form am I mocking anybody's suicide. That is completely ludicrous. And the bars where I'm talking about, you know, you know, the strict diets that they're given, I'm not making fun of eating disorders in any way, shape, or form. I'm simply just talking about these strict diet regimens given from the corporations to the K-pop people that they gotta eat, which are, you know, maybe a piece of bread and water a day, like it's super unhealthy, and that they, so they have these specific, you know, body forms. And, you know, the problem is that y'all just can't take criticism in any way, shape, or form. And the second somebody says something about K-pop you don't like, you're like, racism, xenophobia. You can't take one fucking minute to realize that maybe something's wrong with the K-pop industry. Thank you.